what's updated so let's do a complete multi time frame analysis of usd cad let's see what kind of trading opportunity we have in this instrument now what do you see that this is the four hour time frame we see that usd cad has created another bearish price action in this important level of resistance so we might see further drop from here and before we see how we can trade this bearish move Let, let's do a full multi time frame and then we'll come back again to see the suitable entry point for this instrument first of all what we see on the monthly time frame that usd cat basically overall if we look at the historical data we see that usd cat is in this move in a bearish move if you see from top there has been an impulse followed by this correction there has been another impulse like this and followed by the correction in this correction we saw that usd cat exactly tested this previous support as a resistance and then it has basically has created a head and shoulder pattern in this monthly time frame so we see current month is basically the right shoulder of this head and shoulder and with that being said this is the monthly time frame just after one and a half day this candle is going to be closed and we could see in the last cup last hours last time we could see further drop in this instrument as this is a strong bearish candle and it is likely to drop let's see on the weekly time frame how the price section is forming now weekly as you see that due to the strengthening of cad for the couple of weeks we saw first of all bearish engulfer followed by another bearish candle now this week as well the buyers tried to push the price high in this in this weekly candle this current week what we said just price tested this dodgy this you know there is a reversal pattern here so consolidation and reversal pattern there is a is a sign of change of trend now in this reversal pattern what do you saw the price basically tested this neckline this support as resistance and we see that a strong rejection now with that being said this weekly candle could melt down and even could drop to this level we don't know but we see that the strong the price is very very strongly bearish now let's see on the daily time frame what we have now daily with this the the two days earlier with this daily candle we saw this strong support level tested as a resistance and we saw a rejection now with that being said as with the news release usd cat could drop towards down without any resistance so let's see on the four hour now how we can you know enter a trade now this is the time frame that will be choosing for entering further trade as we are running already one trade from this zone we might add up as soon as we we see further opportunity that's what we do when we win we add up more when we lose we cut the trade when as as with as minimum loss as possible and that is the right way of trading now let's see how we can enter a trade first of all why we think that this instrument is likely to drop further first of all let me draw this level here now what you see after it, it's clearly visible that this level it was a strong level of support and this level after creating a consolidation and you know reversal pattern here this level is broken now with this you know spike to the upside basically the price tested this previous support as resistance and we saw that created a long week candle and with that being said from here we could see because there is a quite quite a few dodgy has been created and you have you may have seen yesterday i have mentioned when this dodgy was formed that this price is likely to drop from here in my streaming and and the price did exactly what it is now this price section basically is a strong bearish price action when you see the price you know was in this channel so the price was moving along this channel towards downside if we draw this channel and we saw that the price basically broke out of this channel tested this created a false breakout and again closed back below in the channel and then started to move down so when you see this kind of price section the the big boys basically hunted the stop loss you know um grab the liquidity now preparing for another bigger drop so the best way at this point for us to add another position is if we see a price again at the 
close of this candle we might place a pending order around this zone keeping our stop loss above this green candle and again targeting at least one to three or one to five risk to reward ratio now if you find value in this analysis then smash the like button and also don't forget to leave a comment below thank you for watching see you soon in my next analysis